A Cumberland Farms clerk in Northbridge helping a man moments after he shot. The victim drove himself to the store in the middle of the night looking for help. WBZ's Anna Myler has the story now from Northbridge. An employee who works for Cumberland Farms tells me there was a shooting up the road. He tells me the victim drove himself right here, went inside the store, and asked the clerk to call 911. A clerk at Cumberland Farms called police around 9.30 last night after a man walked into the store bleeding, appearing to have been shot. An employee who didn't want to appear on camera tells me the man then walked back outside and collapsed. The commotion drew neighbors out of their homes. I saw the guy on the ground with all blood on him and he wasn't really moving really. So it was crazy. It was nuts. Officers blocked off the parking lot with crime tape and could be seen searching inside of a white sedan. Witnesses say the car was riddled with bullets. Soon as I saw the bullet hole in the window, in the uh, car window, then I kind of freaked out. I was like, oh, this is crazy. I never seen this happen before. The district attorney's office says the shooting happened somewhere else and the victim drove himself to Cumberland Farms. Police won't say where the shooting happened, but Michael Spinoza, who lives a short distance away on Beaumont Drive, says he saw a lot of police activity outside of his apartment last night. There had been a lot of commotion. I had noticed there were, you know, a lot of different policemen walking in front of my windows. I kind of was inside, like, what was going on. It was giving me the heebie-jeebies a little bit. The Worcester District Attorney's Office says the victim was taken to a local hospital to be treated. Neighbors say this area has a drug problem, but they aren't used to seeing violence like this. I just hope it doesn't continue because it, it doesn't make you feel safe at all. Right now, we do not know the victim's condition, and there's no word on any arrests. Reporting from Northbridge, Anna Myler, WBZ News.